Uh, how do I feel about the game? I feel that the game is uh, pretty challenging as it, as it requires teamwork and good communication. And uh, it's definitely a game that you would tend to try out due to the challenge that it uh, provides. And the second question, uh, which puzzle do you like the most and why? Uh, I really like the wire cutting as uh, it normally leads to explosions in movies and uh, I was hoping to see that although it didn't. Uh, question 3. Which puzzle do you dislike the most? Why? Uh, I dislike spamming the button most as uh, it hurts my finger. Question 4. Any improvement you want to see made to any of the puzzles? Uh, not really, but uh, I would like to suggest, suggest you adding uh, two puzzle pieces that are maybe like connected or something. Uh, like if you do something to A, B will change something and if you change B, A will be affected also. So, uh, yeah, you get a gist of it. Question 5. Do you like the game that is, Do you think the game is challenging enough? Uh, yeah, it's definitely challenging. Uh, I hope that answers the question. How do you feel about the art aspect of the game? Any improvements to be done to the art? Uh, not really. I think that the art is very unique and it's also part of what makes the game unique. So, no. Question 7. How do you feel about the gameplay aspect of our game? Any improvements to be done to the gameplay? Uh, the gameplay aspect is generally challenging. Uh, however, I feel that uh, you need to make a few different Difficulty like easy, normal, and hard, so that player can uh, attempt that, attempt that uh, at their own pace. Like uh, hard may be too hard for me, so I might want to play in normal difficulty, which is uh, easier and uh, more kid cope. I can cope with it. Yeah. And uh, question eight: How do you feel about the game UI aspect of the game and any improvements? Uh, I feel the aspect is generally placed, and the UI is generally placed in a good position, so no suggestions for improvement for me. If you are to design an instruction page, how would you do it? Uh, I will make it like a book with uh, different pages where a player can uh, flip. Uh, question 10. Do you find the tips and tricks you useful? Uh, yes. Question 11. Do you think 6 puzzles are a reasonable amount of number of puzzles? Uh, yes. 6 is definitely reasonable as uh, each of them takes uh, time to solve it. And uh, But if you do add more, it will be more challenging and fun. Uh, because the more puzzle means you have to repeat less time. Uh, if that makes any sense. Yeah. Okay, uh, so thank you. How do you feel about game? The game is very similar to Keep uh, Talking and Nobody Explodes, which was a game I watched a few YouTubers playing before. Uh, which puzzle did you like the most and why? Uh, from the visuals alone, probably the wire cutting. It's, very, it's a very familiar recurring puzzle trend in games such as Spider-Man. Which puzzle did you like, dislike the most? Why? The C4. The outcome of the, of the game was determined at the start, so it didn't seem very organic and very fun to me. Uh, any improvements you want to see made to any of the puzzles? Um, further explanations of each puzzle we get. Do you think the game is challenging enough? Well, I'm not so sure about how challenging it will be, but visually, probably the number pad if it requires lots of communication. Um, how do you feel about the art aspect of the game? Any improvements to be done to the art? At first, the C4 didn't really seem like a C4 to me, so making it more... Uh, realistic will be a good change. How do you feel about the gameplay aspect of our game? Any improvements to be done to the gameplay? Uh, maybe something unique which sets this game apart from keep talking and nobody explodes. Because as of now, I'm not very convinced that it'll be very fun to play. Uh, how do you feel about the game UI uh, aspect of the game? Any kind of improvements? Maybe a background around the, the puzzles to give it a more distinct theme. If you were to design an instruction page, how would you do it? Mm, instead of a page, maybe teach the- Oh my god, I ran out of power. <laughs> Overall, it's very good. Which puzzle do you like the most? Why? Fleet switches is more challenging as, uh, as most unexpected event. Which puzzle do you dislike the most? Why? 
detonator wire. It's not challenging enough since it's fixed on the anti clockwise. Any improvement you want to see on any puzzle, I think that the detonator wires can be randomized in terms of direction and add indicator on top to show anti clockwise or clockwise. Do you think that the game is challenging enough? No, I feel that the button press puzzle is too easy yet troublesome to play. How do you feel about the art aspect of the game? Any improvement to be done? The art is consistent and nice. How do you feel about the gain aspect of our game? Any improvements to be done to our game? I think that the instruction page is too messy and should be made more clear. How do you feel about our game UI aspect? Improvements? The UI is pretty good and nothing to be improved on. If you are to design the instruction page, well, how will you do it? I will add a quest quest light background to that. Something like MMO or Magical World. Do, do you find do you do you find the tips and tricks helpful? Yes. Do you think the six puzzles are reasonable number of a, 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 a puzzle? Do you think the six puzzles are reasonable number? No, I think the more puzzles should be added. Maybe ten puzzles will be a good number. What the fuck? They do ten uh? That's why they put the The game is very interesting, it is suspenseful, suspenseful, but interesting. And there is really room for improvement for the game engine. Not now, but it can be upgraded upon in the future updates and stuff like that. It can be built upon. That's a good thing. Which, which puzzle do I like the most? Is I like the puzzle with the flip switches, it is the easiest and the least stressful to play. I wouldn't really say dislike, but okay, maybe dislike. Yeah, I I don't really like the detonator wires one because it's not really unpredictable. It's quite predictable and it's easy to play, and so not many people would actually play the detonator wire ones. Any improvements? Well, the detonator parts are definitely that one. Definitely can be improved upon. Do you think the game is challenging enough? I mean, it is challenging enough for now for the six parties that you guys have. What do you feel about the art? The art can have a lot of improvement. It's very plain right now. It's, it needs more shading. Right now, I assume it's a local co-op, so you can still play with many people, but what if it was multiple? It would be definitely more exciting. And, well, if you play with people online, with people you don't know, it will be more fun and have more communication, and you have to really talk to the, uh, the, uh, the other person to tell them the instructions and tell them what to do. The UI is understandable. It's it shows me what I need to do, so I don't have any problem with it. If you have a design and instruction page, how do you need it? Probably more like a paper piece that I can do. Something more retro. But because it's on paper, then it just provides that feel. tips is really useful, it's really really useful as it tells me and suggests to me what I should do if I... Actually I don't really know, I didn't really read the tips, I just skipped. Yeah, I don't really know what this. Do you think the six puzzles are a reasonable number of puzzles? I mean, for now it is since it's 1.0 of the game, but in the future, Add more, 